Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, I've already answered probably five or six calls today about the website saying it's sold out. Um, not actually sold out, guys. Uh, I gotta adjust that camera. Uh, there we go. That's way better. Look at me straightening things up around here. Yeah, that's actually a big mess everywhere. I'm not even playing. I don't know how it happens. You know, I got this new shop and I can turn it into a mess in like five minutes. It's it's crazy. I mean, I want to be tidier, but I'm just not. But anyway, I guess it's because there's so much mayhem around here and I'm so busy. But uh, today, working on these rocker exhausts. I've got about 20 of them. See them in the I got about <laughs> got about 20 of them I'm working on today. Uh, a lot of them are polished and they'll be getting knocked out to finished by end of night tonight. You know, I'm gonna I'm aiming for all 20. Hey, you, you, you got to set goals for yourself, right? So I'm gonna stay up late. I'm gonna work hard. So and try to get them all done. But as I said, y'all looked at the website. You saw, oh, what's going on? There's nothing on the website. Well, okay, I'm sorry about that, but I've got reached about 75 orders. Um, and I just said, whoa, gotta slow them down. And the only way to do that is to put sold out on the website and, and to put a little explanation right under the picture that says, look, um, not sold out, look. They'll be back. I, I just gotta slow down right now. I got too many sales. Too many sales I can't keep up. It does me no good to take your money today and then in a week and a half, you'd be like, well, are you going to give me my product? Are you going to give me my refund? <laughs> so, so I just, rather than have to get refunds and and, uh, and do that, I, um, <laughs> I just rather not take the sale. Not right now. But what you can do is you can get on the email list, rlsexhaust at yahoo.com. That's my email for the for the business. Uh, email me. I'll put you on the list. As soon as we're accepting orders, I'll contact you and give you a discount as well. Uh, but right now, I just I have so many sales. I just had one order come in for 35 exhausts for a company up in Canada. So, whoa. And I already had, like I say, over, I actually over 30 on the board. So I'm over, I'm over 75. I don't even know exactly what it was, but it made me go, what? And I freaked out and I told my wife, I said, babe, I got to take some kind of control or I'm going to have a hundred exhaust to build and it's just going to be too much for me. I'm just going to be over overwhelmed because uh, it's, it's just me. That's it. That's all is here. It's just me doing this stuff. So um, if you've ordered it, bear with me. If you haven't got a tracking number, please be aware. You won't get a tracking number until I put it in the box. Once it goes in the box, label goes on it then UPS is going to email you a tracking number you won't get any notification from me until it goes in that box so uh, just just let you know uh, that, that's how it works as soon as as soon as it goes into the box you'll get that tracking number uh, it'll be automated either through PayPal or through uh, uh, eBay or well actually eBay you know I just shut eBay down completely turned my store off. I used them for like 15 years and they're a great, they're a great company or were a great company. Now they've evolved into something else. It's kind of like Facebook, YouTube. Uh, they're evolving and you know, I can honestly tell my customers, don't buy it from eBay, buy it from a website because if you buy it from a website, you may not even be charged any sales tax, for example. In some states, I, I don't have to pay sales tax to the government unless it re reaches a threshold. Well, um, if I if I haven't read that threshold, I don't have to take your sales tax. Meaning, you don't gotta pay no sales tax through the website. Where if you go to eBay, you'll pay those sales taxes. They're gonna collect them. And if, if you only sell $2 or $50, you're gonna collect those sales taxes, and they're gonna send them to the state. Where through the website, you're not gonna experience that. Uh, I only have to pay sales tax here in Texas, and in states that I go over their limit of how much you have to sell in your state before you charge those So that's just something to consider. One more reason why I shut down eBay. Mainly their fees and just, just 
they do business differently, the way they pay you and all that stuff. It's just, it was ridiculous. I was like, you know what? They got stuff so confusing now, you don't even know if you're getting messed around with. So I, I, I decided, you know what? Rather than be messed around with, let's just, we got so much work, we're closing that. As much as they were, were so important in the beginning to help me get this company started uh, with sport bike exhaust. They really helped me grow, uh, but it, it wasn't. It, 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 it's not needed anymore. The website itself has enough traffic now uh, through through all my different avenues of advertising that uh, don't need any baby anymore. So save yourself some money. Go straight to the website. You don't need to look there unless you're looking for a used one, which you might find there from an individual. And, and I, you know, definitely go do that. Uh, uh, or you know what I say, build your own, you know what I mean? Get, get stuff together, make it happen. Uh, but, oh my goodness. So, back to what I was doing. Because I can do it and I can talk to you too, you know? Uh, so, to clear that all up, I have shut off eBay completely. They're no longer even turned on and closed the store down. Um, I have made everything unavailable on the website except for 1330 cat deletes and polished because I can knock those out pretty quickly uh, and grills for the Riker uh, and uh, cool air intakes I let I left the, those available because uh, I can get those knocked out pretty quick as well but everything else on the site is marked sold out just to make it to where I can uh, get caught up here you know with, with this volume of work I just needed some kind of relief. I already gave one refund, and I was like, you know what? I don't want to do this again. Last year, I had a couple people get very angry because they didn't want to wait on the product, so I just thought, you know, maybe it's time to shut it off. So that's what I did. But, uh... Guess what? You don't get a ground clamp, you get a shot. But uh, hey guys, I really appreciate y'all watching. Uh, and give me just a second and I'll show you the new product that's coming out. I believe I have at least one over here on the floor. It's finished. I mean it's gotta be it's gotta be ceramic coated still. It's something that's getting shipped up to uh, rolling on three. Keith Hamer, he's got his own podcast, pretty cool guy, uh, check into him, uh, he's gonna, he'll be reviewing this product, telling you what he thinks about it, and I got two also on the floor here for Thrill Mouse Moto, Barry Comp out there, uh, in Texas, right here where I live, but I'm gonna put this new one out, uh, I'm not sure on the, uh, on the, uh, the name yet, So, y'all want to give me suggestions or names for this new exhaust? And I know you're going to say, how's it sound? It sounds badass. <laughs> Just so you know, it sounds awesome. I mean, I really like it. It's a little mellower, but yet it's still got some bite to it. But it ain't, it ain't, it ain't a ferocious pit bull like some of my other exhausts. <laughs> So I've been I've been thoroughly enjoying it, and it's got a really cool style to it. And, and again, I'll show you in just a second after I finish this uh, this circular well here. Oh wow! Yeah, the weather is just really yucky here. It's uh oh, my earbud fell out. You know, I needed to take those out before I started this video and I didn't even think about it. I've been having earplugs in the whole time I make the video. That makes a lot of sense, huh? Well, I listen to audio books. I was just listening to a book before I decided I was going to make this video. I was uh, listening to some sci-fi trash. And that's what it was, but, you know, you know how we love our trash. <laughs> I've been listening to lots of audio books and I'm so, it's so hard to find a good audio book.
actually, not audiobook. That's not what I'm listening to today. I've been listening to podcasts today that are that are stories, like story podcast. It's so hard to find a good one of those, I should say. I have came across a couple that are very interesting, and, and I've really been enjoying them. Uh, but just like with a TV show, you know how you just power watch? Well, I power listen. And I just listen to the whole podcast in like three hours. I'm like, whoa. piece hooks up with springs mounting bracket twin outlet it's available in black or or this matte color here with the logo you know that's there's gonna be your two options here's my wife with my lunch show the lunch babe what's the lunch Dun, dun, ah. I just dumped my pizza on the floor. Here, bring up the fire. Here. I'm very sad. Just laugh. She's gonna make me another pizza, even after I just threw it on the floor. I'm so sorry, dear. Well, things happen. Things happen around here, around the shop. Pizza down, homemade pizza, and I just threw it on the floor. Uh, lucky enough, to have a wonderful wife. Hey, dogs. Pizza. Come on, Max. Max, this you'll clean up the pizza. Cheese. Hot. Oh, I burned Max's lips. He didn't like that. So, as they clean up the pizza, <laughs> is it too hot, Max? As they clean up the pizza here, I'll talk about this. This is the new model, and uh, what do y'all think about a name for this? I mean, really, what's, what's up? What, what's your what's your opinion on this this design? I mean, it looks radical, and and I'm not gonna cut this video together and do any editing on it at all. Because, my goodness, that was greatness. I just totally dropped a pizza and my super wife is gonna make me another one. And my dogs just ate it, so good content, huh? <laughs> uh, like I said, things happen. Um, but, I need a name for this. Uh, Shadow Black, he, he says, name of the Shadow Series. You know, I was, I was actually thinking about Shadow Riders. Uh, Shadow Rider Series, um, or Shadow Series, or, but I need, I need some ideas. I need, I need some I need some ideas for what you think this should be called. I mean, it's, it's got a really cool look to it, uh, and it actually sounds phenomenal. I've been running it for about two weeks now. Uh, I've got another guy testing it. He loves it. He's already requested some for his business. He's like, hey, can I get some of that? You know, I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> but hey, uh, if you're interested in this new model, uh, you'll be have to get on that waiting list because this is not on the website and won't be available until I start taking orders again. But this is my newest model. I've got materials to build 50 of these right now, so I can take 50 orders on this particular model. And now, of course, I'm going to continue to make them if they sell like crazy, like I think they will. Uh, but man, taking you a little bit to clean up that pizza, Max. Big German Shepherd. I thought he could eat it up a little bit quicker than that. <laughs> Uh, 14 minutes, 15 seconds. Oh my goodness, this is a long video. But hey guys, help me name this exhaust. Um, if, if, there's, if, if you come up with something that I've already already have on my list, which I have a short list already, I'm not even gonna say those names, but I do have a little short list of names that I considered and I, uh, I don't, I, I'm going, I'm, I'm not, not sure. Um, shoot me some name ideas. If I choose your name, and you're the first person to to contact me with that name, you know. Um, well, if you're the first person to to list that name in, in a comment, I, I might just give you one of these silver ones for free. But anyway, uh, 
come on now, help me, help me name it, uh, and, and let's uh, let's see where this goes. It's coming to you soon. RLS exhaust. I don't know what to call it. It looks bad to the bone, but hey, check it out. Pretty, pretty awesome. Bone. Yeah. I think you are gonna love it. I think you're gonna love it. It's uh, it's it is still loud. But it's a, it's not a ear piercing loud. It's a, it's a, it's a nice, it's nice. You know, like I say, I, I, I'm enjoying it. But hey, you make your own opinions. And videos coming soon. I'm not gonna put, I'm not chopping it together in this this video. But videos will be coming soon. I've already made some videos on my bike of this of this exhaust. Uh, but like I said, this is going straight from the phone, straight to you guys. Let you know what's going on and what's what's coming. And I still need help naming this bad boy right here. Bad boy? I don't know. Someone said badass. And I said, ooh, babe, I can. It, that means every time that someone asks what kind of exhaust you can, you can say, it's a badass exhaust. And I thought, man, that's a badass name. No doubt about it. But it's a little bit, you know, I guess it's a little bit. I don't know. Badass is pretty cool, though. Actually, that's the number one. Hey, he wants that pizza more than the other dog. <laughs> that's the number one name so far. What kind of exhaust you got? I got a badass exhaust, man. <laughs> I love it. But anyway, hey, I need some help naming this exhaust. Badass, my wife is saying is not appropriate. <laughs> I understand, way. I understand, honey. It's not appropriate. But, uh, hey, what do you think? What do you think we should call it? Right now, this is probably my favorite exhaust. I'm not going to joke with you. This is probably my favorite sounding exhaust because it's not over the top. Now, if you're not looking for over the top, let me break this down to you on how my exhausts work. I have two different styles of exhaust. Some use this style of muffler, this primary in the middle. You know, it's a glass pack style, stainless steel with a bath all the way through the middle. Others use a larger muffler body. This has got packing on it to make it where it doesn't get scratched, but uh, I use a, a larger stainless steel muffler body like this one. And the ones that use this muffler body, of course, they absorb more sound. They're going to be quieter. They'll be a lot quieter. They're going to uh, not be half as loud, but they're going to be quieter. The Core Series, the Stealth Series, the Controlled Chaos Series, and the Punisher Series with the larger muffler body. And you'll see that in the drop down menu on the color option for the Punisher series. They cleaned up all that pizza. Them dogs are bad to the bone. Bad to the pizza. <laughs> but anyway, thanks Max. Thanks for cleaning it up. You're a great, you're a great dog. I hope it doesn't affect his belly now. Um, but uh, hey, 18 minutes. It just keeps getting longer. That's a long video. Hey, help me name this exhaust. You can be the winner. I know you want to be a winner. I'm not handing out chicken dinners, but you could be a winner winner. How about a winner winner exhaust winner? Hmm? Winner winner exhaust winner. Now, name this exhaust. Be the first person to name it. You're, you're getting one. It's just that simple. I need the help. I need your help. Help me name this exhaust. Coming soon from RLS Exhaust to you. Man, I can't believe I dropped my pizza trying to make a video. Ugh, it cost me a homemade pizza. That was a little bitty mini pizza. It had, it had yellow bell peppers or and red bell peppers and cheese and pepperoni. And my wife is a superwoman. Uh, if you got a wife and she's a superwoman, please let her know. She deserves it. All right? And y'all have a great day. Uh, be nice to someone. Uh, and, and maybe they'll be nice to you. All right? Y'all have a great day. Let's take this glove off just to turn the camera on. Y'all have a good one.